Kim Queen. I just graduated high school from Stewart Hall School in Virginia. And before that, I went to high school here, like the first two years of high school here in Hanoi, in Newton Grammar School. So why do you want to go to study abroad? Well, initially, I wanted to just basically meet new people and new ideas and try out different cultures because well when you spend 16 years in one setting it can get actually kind of weird because that's all you know and i want to know more so after two years how is the book changing your yourself well i think i'm more open to new ideas now because when you go out and you see people doing different things than yours, you will stop seeing difference as like negative aliens. You will, you will just start like, accepting others more, I guess. So uh, you study one year in uh, high school in Vietnam and two years in high school in the US. So can you explain what difference between two styles of study? Well, Vietnamese students take more classes. Well, instead of, instead of taking 11 classes per year in the U.S., I only have to take like um, six or seven. Um, only two or three of which are mandatory in the rest I get to choose. So it gets, so it, it gives me more option to direct my future studying career because it gives me opportunities to just explore what exactly what I want to explore. Do you have any uh, difficulties when you study in the US? Um, you will miss your home food. You will miss the food a lot. But I guess if you, if you arm yourself with the knowledge that you are stepping into an environment that is entirely different and you just kind of prepare yourself to raise the impact, then it's going to be okay. So, um, what about uh, the support from Sunrise Vietnam? So, do you have any comment for Sunrise Vietnam? I like Sunrise. Like, they, they really did their job. They really, they found out the scholarship opportunities for me. They consider where I want to live and they consider what I want to do in the future even though it's just high school and it shouldn't matter that much then but they still consider it so that's very thoughtful of them and they really did their job very well So do you have any uh, message for the student who want to study abroad in the future? Uh, my message is not to worry too much because this is something I see in my fellow students who are just starting to go abroad, they stress out a lot about their visas and their and the difference between cultures. And to be honest, if you just if you just practice yourself to be open to new things and be willing to try new things, then it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be fun actually. So what your future plan? Uh, I'm planning to study art, probably in SCAD, Atlanta, Georgia. I'm excited. Okay. I'm going to paint and do stuff like that. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Okay.